water. Earth. What's poppin' everybody? It's your boy Snowy Kurama, and we are here for episode number 10 of our Pokemon Black Randomized Avatar Lock. In the last episode, we got to Pinwheel Forest, and today we are going to go through it and get to Castalia. You know, stop Team Plasma and all that. So, I'm gonna address the whole uploading thing. I know I haven't uploaded this kind of project in the last couple of days as far as like the beginning of uh, December goes. I think this one will probably be going up the middle. Maybe middle, like the, the third week of December around Christmas time, I think. So by then it should be definitely uh, addressed or corrected, I guess, because you know, finals kind of suck. College student, all that. So hopefully this series will pick back up again and Let's go look into our team. That's something that we know how to do. <clears throat> we got the same group as we did last time. We got Rat, the they're Raticate, Brave Nature. We got Guts, and Hyper Fang, Bite, Quick Attack, and Sucker Punch are our moves. And we got Woof, the Stoutland, Brave Nature as well. Intimidate, we got Bite, Take Down, Break Up, and Odor Sleuth. Amp, the Loudred, which is, which is Impish. We got Soundproof for our ability, we got Pound Assange, Bite, and Howl. We got a Yolanda the Survivor, our Pachirisu. Naughty Nature, we got Spark Bide, Swift, and Charm with Runaway, Runaway as our ability. And last but not least, we got our Starter Azula, the Charizard. Docile Nature, holding a Charcoal with Blaze, which powers up our Ember <laughs> at some point, with Dragon Rage, Scratch, and Spokescreen as well. I'm eventually going to go through our, move, our items and... I'm going to actually, it's not what I wanted, I'm going to actually add an item to our team here. This Toxic Orb is going to be given to Rat, because we got Guts. So hopefully um, it won't, I'm actually going to go back and heal. Hopefully that won't bite us in the butt and kill our Raticate. Oh yeah, to reflect, uh, reflect. I had reflect up. My defenses are raised. Uh, my repel. Yeah, it's winter now. Makes sense. Oh, thanks, lady. Damn it. And at this point... <laughs> Uh, PDL week one has just, and we have gone into week two. Well, actually, we were like halfway into week two, so hopefully people are making their teams and whatnot for their next bout. I know I'm playing the Monica Melodics, and I'm not very... <laughs> I'm quite scared. <laughs> hey, kid. Get out of here. I'm trying to stop Team Plasma. Oh, here we go. A rat, get him. Let's go, Hyper Fang. I don't even think our Toxic Orb's gonna activate. Alright, let's see it. Quick attack. Bam. Yeah, that's how we do it. Oh, I'm happy to be using this tech. Play it all. I'm gonna keep battling. You are weak to dark. I have bite. We are guts boosted. That's some damage. That is some damage. All right. Luckily for us. Uh, Gen 5 does not have the poison damage every time you take a step, just like previous generations do. 
so we don't actually have to worry about that. Numbul could have been our encounter in here. I think our encounter was Woof, so we don't gotta worry. Would have been a nice fire type to have in the PC as well as a good ground type. You know, to add to our water weakness and our... Not exactly help our flying... Braviary would have been great too, because that would have helped out our fighting weakness. <laughs> about ready to set up another repel. In fact, that's probably a good idea. Alright. Odd. I thought that was going to be a, one of the rangers. There's the ranger. That scared me the first time I ever saw it. I was like, ah! It popped up from the fucking bushes. Okay, let's let's use English. It popped up from the bushes. Ooh, clink. Luckily for you, this is Gen 5, so you resist everything. So I'm gonna go out to the one thing you don't. Azula! Azula! Get out here, girl. Get out you know what really grinds my gears? I guess Azula does, I don't know. Let's use Ember to get this bitch out of here. This thing's a baby form of the, of the uh, Kling Clang, which is a proud member of the Season 3 Chicago White Sox, fun fact. Oh, Chesto Berry. Very useful. No, no, no. That's not another boy. I thought it would be. This is, though. Yep. I don't know why all these people are in my way. I'm trying to stop Team Plasma, and they're like, nah, it was a battle instead. It's kind of fucked. Very selfish. Sends out Karadon. Eradicate should totally be faster, and this gust, Guts Boosted Hyper Fang should do the trick. It does not do the trick. Rest in pieces, buddy. What? This Crawdont won't die. I don't know why I didn't use Spark. I, I figured that it would not live that. I guess. Well, I guess we keep this damn Toxic Orb until we find something else with Guts. Too bad for Gliscor, because it's ground type. Let's make Woof out here. Leading the pack. It really sucks. I can't afford to lose anybody else. I don't exactly remember where all the gift Pokemon are in this game, if there are any. The fact that we can't seem to catch any encounters really suck too. Grumpig. You know what would have been great? A sucker punching or a biting guts boosted eradicate. That would have been fantastic. We have bite here though, so I mean. Confuse Ray now! Wait. Well, better late than never to figure out that I'm, I wasn't recording my freaking <laughs> game audio. 
need to click in the window now. Shit. Alright, get out of here, you. Thank you, Wolf. MVP of the day, right here. Ah, oh, Skeet, level 21. Yep, I'm here to buy time. And if you don't step lively, we're going to get away. Shut the fuck up. I wish that would give you an item. Spooky plate? I don't think we have any ghost moves on our team besides maybe Amp. Amp has a ghost move, I think, right? Yep. Oh, you're gonna get the spooky plate, buddy. Yep, one of them was gonna be one of the damn rangers. Killed my Redicate! Chandelure! Oh, wow! <laughs> oh, wow! Um, we're gonna try to take this out as quickly as we can. Flame Burst, please don't do too much. I'm so happy I didn't use Work Up first. We're definitely gonna be healing here. Super potion. <laughs> woof, 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 buddy. Stop that! Although I think we go first, don't we? We don't. I think we'll live, though. We should. Please live! Yes! Get out of here, you bitch. I did, I was, I did not sign up for all this stress. Hey, shut up. Stupid ass. Got pet a berry from you. We are taking this opportunity to go ahead and heal up. Yeah, this isn't the way we need to go. I don't think there's anything over here. Not for us yet. It's the wild mumble. Spoiler alert, but that's where we get Verizon later. Verizon Wireless, as the kids say. Alright, you're wasting my time, little buddy. Get out of here. Please and thank you. Can't get to that little thing yet, because... I think we have to be on the other side. Last one, I think. A Pessoa. Uh, ha ha. A kid like you beat some of us. That can't be helped, but I'll take you on now. Please have little boy Pokemon. That that's all I need. Have little boy Pokemon. <laughs> Surskit. All right, Wolf. This guy can be gone with a one take down, I think. Considering Sir Skit's shitty stats. And that's how it that's how it do around here. That is how it do around here. Shellman. I'm gonna go to Azula. Because of type coverage or typing advantage, I should say. Chill, man. Amber, please and thank you. Alright. That is that. Oh, nope. Grovile. Good thing we're 
I have Azula out here. Quick attack, oh no! Amber, oh yes! Alright. And that is a level 24. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Uh... Fine, take your stupid skull. Ha, <laughs> we got the head. <sighs> so the dream our king had, the dream we had, won't come true. How are you holding up, fellow subject of our king? Gorm of the Seven Sages. I'm mortified that this skull, which we went to so much trouble to obtain, was stolen from us so easily. It's not important. We can afford to abandon the dragon's skull. According to the results of our research, this is not the legendary Pokemon for which Team Plasma is looking. It is completely unrelated. But we will not allow anyone to disrupt our plans and get away with it. We will fix it so you never interfere with us again. Mmm, oh sweet. The bug Pokemon were getting all worked up, so here I come. And what do I spy with my little eye? This important looking guy. Are you here to help your friends who I'm defeated? Snowy, Berg, the others didn't have anything. And who are you supposed to be? Is this the guy, the big boss? I am one of the Seven Sages of Team Plasma. Getsus, another of the Seven Sages, will liberate Pokemon with words alone. The remainder of the Seven Sages have ordered their compatriots to take Pokemon with full force. But the odds are little against us now. To you, the bug Pokemon user Berg, and the normal Pokemon user Lenora, I say. Know your enemies, know yourself, and you need not fear the result of a hundred battles. This time, we shall retreat quietly. To secure the liberation of Pokemon, we will steal Pokemon from trainers. Even though you are gym leaders, we will not tolerate any further obstruction from you. In any case, we will settle this someday. I hope you are looking forward to that time as much as I. You little bitch. They're a speedy bunch. What are you planning to do, Berg? Are you going to chase them? Hmm. We got back the stolen skull, and if we corner them, there's no telling what they might do. I think I'll be heading back, Lenora. Well now, well. I'll be waiting for you to your challenge at the Castelia City's Pokemon Gym. Yes, indeed. I'm certainly looking forward to it. Snowy! You're holding the dragon skull you worked so hard to get back, right? Snowy, thank you so much. With a kind trainer like you taking care of them, the Pokemon with you must be happy. Here's a token of my gratitude. Please use it carefully. Moonstone. Nice. This is a Moonstone. Some Pokemon evolve when you use this item on them. Now I must take back the Dragon Skull to the museum. See you. Take care of yourself. Bye, bitch. Alright. Oh. Almost went too far. Custap Berry. What the shit does that do? I bet it's useless. Gets to move first once. Oh. Instant priority. Sounds like something I should use in the PDL. <laughs> This right here is the whole reason that I bought that I bought this game. Oh, not the quick claw, but what we're about to see next. Hmm. This bridge right here, the Sky Arrow Bridge. I saw this on TV when I was about out of Pokemon, and I just saw how glorious this thing looked. Because back in 2010, this was crazy amazing. It still kind of is pretty cool. But back then, it was just like, holy shit, that is awesome. It was, it was the best. This music is pretty good, too. 
I wanted so badly to be on this bridge. <laughs> now I'm not gonna talk to any of these guys, they won't say anything important. Pokemon needs more, uh, stuff like this. Because since 5th gen, they haven't really done anything like this. I'm not sure if it's because they can't with the 3 mo 3D modeling yet, or if they just haven't wanted to, wanted to keep that kind of, uh, specific to Unovo, but... I don't know. They just haven't. And we're here in Castalia City. There's one last thing I want to do before we, uh, or even considering ending off. Yeah, we know, we know, we know about Geonet. Please stop. First things first, we're gonna heal our Pokemon. Second, we're gonna drop off our fallen ally, and then we're gonna try to maybe pick one up in the uh, route after Castalia City. Then after that, we will explore the entire town, which will probably take like 70 episodes, who knows. This place is so damn big and I get lost all the time. Ah, oh, shit. And here we see our fallen comrades, Rebecca, Tribe, and Rat. We miss you. Even you, Tribe, even though you haven't done anything and you were kind of only there, so we wouldn't be able to have to catch another one. Uh, does it work with the Great Balls, too? I'm not actually sure. Nah, it doesn't. It's just Pokeballs. Oh, well. I had a bunch of items. We have a bunch of trainers to battle in this city, too. I'm not exactly sure where you get a rod. I think this might be the game where you don't get a rod until like the post game. You don't get like the super rod until later. I'll have to look that up. But if we do get the rod uh, sometime soon, then we could potentially get a Castalia City encounter with uh, kind of by the ports. This game doesn't have the sewer system, so we can't get an encounter there, unfortunately. Ugh. All right, I'm gonna grab this item first too. Comet shard. All right, some cash money. Something we can use, please. Something we can use. Snorlax. I'm not that mad if I'm being completely honest. This is another normal type, so fighting types still fuck us up. But Snorlax is a beefy boy. I'm not mad about this. I don't think we have any status ailments on this team, do we? Uh, nope. 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 And nope. I will switch into Azula, though. So that we can Dragon Rage this thing. <clears throat> Amnesia. Could even get away with uh, membering it now, I think. I would rather not burn it, though. Alright. Oh, I think I'm going to go ahead and try a ball now. <laughs> this thing has less HP than I was anticipating. Plus the sandstorm. Yeah, we have to start throwing. Take a great ball, buddy. Bought these just for you. One. Two. Three. Finally! We catch a freaking encounter! <laughs> awesome! When its belly is full, it becomes too lethargic to even lift a finger, so it's safe to bounce on its belly. Huh. Of course. Now, what do we name a male Snorlax? What do we name a male Snorlax? Hmm. 
I'm thinking about naming it after Matt because of his team, the Munch Laxatives. It's been the Snorlaxatives before. Or just, uh, big. Big boy. Because that's what he is. He's a big boy. Oh, he's got an item? What you got? Moonstone. We got another Moonstone. It's got thick fat, resists fire and ice type moves. That's pretty awesome. Defense curl, amnesia, lick, and belly drum. Not as awesome. I hope we have some TMs in the city. <laughs> Who knows, I might even explore this route sometime just to see if we can get anything else. I'm not sure if we can get like a static or something in the desert. I'll have to look that up too. Until then, is it back to the Pokemon Center? <clears throat> yeah. And uh, hopefully, there's like a TM H, not HM, but like a TM shop here that can teach big boys some stuff. That'd be fantastic. Maybe even give it a citrus berry for that belly drum tech. I feel like we have a citrus berry, I'm not exactly sure. Alright, healing our five mons. Good, good, good. Do we have a TMHM shop here? This is not that. I really, really hope you can't hear my dog going frickin' ape shit in the background. We, our TMs are kind of bad too. Can you learn water gun? Cannot. Not gonna waste time with uh, moonlight, but can you? Can anybody learn toxic spikes? Because we could set up the spikes <laughs> and just go in. I actually kind of want to do that. I'm not teaching it to Yolanda. Yolanda can't take it that well, even though she's she's our survivor. You don't need Odor Sleuth. I'm gonna teach this thing Toxic Spice just because <laughs> we could always get rid of it. So cuts are only move we can actually teach anything, which kind of sucks. But I guess I'm gonna go ahead and just end it off here. I will go ahead and. Uh, Sorry about that little last minute uh, interruption, but as I was saying, I'm going to go ahead and end it off here, do some research about this city. So, uh, like this video if you, you know, did. Subscribe if you have not already. Tickle that bell so that you know what I'm doing. And this has been your boy, Snowy Kurama. See you in the next video. Goodbye.